repeat after me. Uh, uh, no, you stay on. Uh, uh, no, you stay on. Uh, uh, don't fucking move from that note. Uh, uh, no, God damn it, John. Okay. All right, all right. Focus. I'm going to change notes. You're going to stay on the fucking same note. Uh, that's a major chord please remove that we don't need to be it's inception <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> uh, technology's fun Hey, welcome to Rim Tim Timmy's Fun Time Hour. <laughs> I'm Rim Tim Timmy. No, you're not. Okay, well, we're going to officially start now. Should I stop it? No, you should, you should let me do the proper introduction. Okay. I don't have the enthusiasm now to do it correctly. No, you, come on, you can do it. You literally stole my thunder. You can do it. No, you stole my thunder. You pulled the rug. I believe in you. You can do it. Okay. Welcome to Welcome to Rim Tim Timmy's Fun Time Hour. That was great. I'm your host. I guess Rim Tim Timmy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was great. Do you like just like killing precious things? No. Stomping on people's dreams. No. I don't know. I don't even like hurting bugs. Oh, I do. You do? I can get off on it. Okay. What's the last bug you stepped on? Um, probably a spider outside of my old house. It, there was a just, it was infested with spiders. People are going to get upset with you for saying that. It had a lot of spiders. Well, you got to live and let live, man. You got to, you got to let them, let them live their spider lives. Have you? What was the last bug that you ever smashed or smushed? Mm. 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 I'm talking years, years ago. Years ago, there was one. There was one bug. Is that it? That's the whole story? Mm -hmm. Come on. Well, there's more there. No, that's that's all. I, that's all I have. It's kind of a rainy night tonight, is it not? Oh, oh, you got to get that. Oh, my Lord. What days are you available next week? Was that a date? No. Well, what? Who who asked who if you're available? My accountant. Hey Jeff, you know any scary stories? Yeah, I got one about my accountant. Okay, what? Well, ooh, ooh, what is it? Uh, last year I owed some taxes. Oh, and they oh did the tax man come for you? Yeah. Did the, did the how much did you owe? Five hundred dollars. That's it. It's a lot of money. How much did you make that year? Uh, well, after taxes. You don't think that's a lot of money? $500 to owe on taxes is not crazy. It's not a ton of money. Oh, Mr. Big Shoes. No. Mr. No. Businessman. No, I'm just saying Mr. that. Mr. High Tax Bracket over here. I'm not. Here. I am not a Mr. high tax Roth bracket. Mr. Roth IRA. I mean, I have a Roth IRA. Mr. Four, 401k. Do you have a 401k, Jeff? No. A Roth IRA? No. A savings account? No. Yes, you do. You have a savings account. You have a savings account at your bank, right? I don't know. Yeah, sure. I don't need you. I like losing my tax, man. $500 is not a lot of money. It is you? a lot of money. That was... You know it's what you not, could do? It's, it's you not a lot of money with... to owe on your tax. Like, it's not a scary amount of money to owe on your, owe on your I taxes. I was terrified. 
Mr. Money Shoes McGee. I am not Money Shoes. Mr. I am not Money Groove. I am not Money Shoes. Goober. I am not Money Shoes. I am I am ha- I am I am happy uh, regular shoes. Your regular shoes, huh? Regular shoes, Magoo. Not yeah. happy. Not money shoes, McGee. You know, to regular shoes, five hundred dollars is a lot of money. It is a lot of money. I'm just saying, it's not a lot of money to own on your taxes. Like oh, you're not gonna, yeah. you're not gonna be broke. Like you're not, you're not gonna go. You're not gonna, you know. You're, you're gonna be able to pay it off probably. You don't know that. I mean, money is scary, though. Yeah. Money can be scary. Debt. Debt. Debt D- is scary. E T. The three letters. Money really makes people insane. They're, like money has done like has has made people just do weird, crazy things. Like, have you heard that so many, many lottery winners have like died or been murdered by people they knew? Or what do you do? Are you listening at all? You're not. I'm what are you doing? The, I'm getting the mic in the right place. Oh, are you? To properly listen. Okay. There's a lot of metal between me theme? and you. Is, do, we have, do we have a theme every week? I think it's fair to ask that because this is still a pretty early episode. Why do you need a theme? I don't... I mean, do, it's a lot of, a lot of uh, shows have gimmicks and themes. You want a gimmick? All right. Let's come up with a gimmick. Um, no, I don't want to. I'm just asking if we have um, one. Um, like- celebrity talk. Uh, the Chris Pratt's in the news. Uh, his church is uh, anti-gay. What do you have to say about that? Oh my God! Why did I? Why? What I? Why did That's, I? Ask? Come on! What do you think about Chris Pratt I and Ellen Page? Ellen him Page. In- She's a, she's Ellen a Page person. had a big celebrity fight. Hey, whose corner are you in? I liked him in Parks and Rec, but I don't know what his beliefs are. Ellen Page was not in Parks no, and Rec. No, but Chris Pratt was. Chris Pratt was in, in Parks and Rec. So you're anti-gay. No, oh my, what? If you what? like Parks and Recs, you must be anti-gay. I can't deal with this character. Uh, you know, we, you know, uh, I spent some time in Mario Lopez's uh, uh, former house. Really? Why were you there? Who's Big Shoes McGee now? Why were you in Mario Lopez's old house? I had a rehearsal. Great story. It's true. I'm not lying. No, I know. Oh, yeah, because you've had a rehearsal in Mario Lopez's former house. No, I've never had a rehearsal at Mario Lopez's former house. Yeah, that's right. That makes me better than you. You've got better celebrity stories than that. I may not owe five hundred dollars on my taxes, but I've never been in, in Mario Lopez's former house. That's true about me. Exactly. That's why I'm saying it. Hey, did you watch Save by He was on Save by the Bell. I bet you watched the show growing up. A little bit. It probably means a lot that I was in Mario Lopez's house. I no, I'd be more impressed if you were like on like the guy who wrote on the music sca- for Doug. Like if you were hanging out with with him, with uh, Fred Newman. What? No, no. You really don't think it's that cool that I was hanging out at Mario Lopez's former house? It's cool. He was the he he used to be the landlord. No, he if was. You uh, own a, he was if, Slater, right? Yeah. Well, I'm talking about this post saved by the bell years. If you own a house, you're the house's landlord. Not necessarily. You can own a house and not be the landlord? Yeah, you just own a house. You're the property owner of a house. Which is a landlord. I think you're only all a landlord. House owners, all house owners are landlords, but not all landlords are house owners? I think, if, if, I think you can own a plot of land and not put a house on it, and then you would still be a, a landlord. landlord. And you say, I'm the lord of this land. That's what I was getting at. And then, and then I'm like... I'm the lord of this I'm land. I'm the lord of this land. And then like someone walks... But I do not own a house. No houses. And someone comes no walking around. No houses here. And then someone says, you owe me $500. And then they say, wait, what a minute. I thought this was an empty field. I'm the landlord. And the tax man. Yes. Uh, so, yeah. 
Wow. And if somebody and if somebody shows up and says, I would like to build a house here, it goes, no house is here. No house is here. This is strictly land. Only land Only on my land. Only land from as far as the eye can see. You want to build a house? You build it over there. How, how great would it have been for some when you just... When 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 people were heading west to claim land and then people were like, wait a minute, I can just I can just run out west and own and own I, land. Uh, I own all of this. And then the president All I gotta do is put down all a the stake. president uh, the president of the United States was like, Yep. Yeah. You but- just run out there with your wagon and you you can keep it. It's all your what whatever you can hold on to is yours. Man, it would be pretty Yeehaw, bang bang. It would be pretty great to go back to times where, in order to own something, all you have to do is put down a stake. This is my claim. I claim this is mine. That's it. Like, yeah. if I could go into Best Buy and, like, when the PS5s come out, just put a stake through it. Yeah. Like, sir, you broke that now. You, you, but you at least it's that. mine. Okay. That'll be $799 for the or new PS5. Or if I could walk into McDonald's and, and go back there and, and, and put a stake through a Big Mac... Like you're not allowed back here, sir. I go, well, it's mine to, now. You're, we're, you're not. You need. You need to leave, sir. We're gonna call security. And I go. Too bad. It's mine. I put a stake through it. What else could you put stakes through? Vampires. Not real, John. Ah! This vampire is mine. It's not it's a real like, thing. Uh, it's, it's not a real thing. God and then damn their it. Skin like crumbles out. Yeah, but no. no I'm talking about reality. I'm talking about, I want to put a stake. Hmm. You could put a stake through a stake. Yeah, I was thinking about that. That's a pretty easy easy one. Low-hanging fruit. Yeah. Anyway. You can't put a stake through time. You can't? No. Uh, because because uh, time does not exist. Time's a flat circle. Sure. Sure. Well, whatever gets you through the day, John. You know, I don't want to have a, an existential talk here. You know... Isn't it weird we're, that we're all we're, we're all, all made of, of dying. we're all made oh, of okay we're all made of carbon. Oh you know? god, yeah, because yeah, all right. Like here we go. I'm made of this. All right, and yeah. this. Uh huh. And this. And we're all energy, right? And and you. Sure. You, we're, all we're all made, made of the same stuff, right? You know, molecules and atoms. We're just the same. You know, hey, I'm I'm same. six foot one. You're five foot nine. That's it's just true. the way it works. That's not true at it's all. It's just the way it worked out. Our molecules stacked one. a little differently, but at the end of the day, we're the I'm same. Six, one. We're the same. I'm a little more handsome. You're, you take you your, got some ugly eyes. You could take like, your cursors. At the end of the day, we're measure, the same stuff. Measure your you know, scale. You know, it's like it's like it's like um, it's uh, taller by about It's like I have I have a I have a three octave range. You have a two octave range. Well, that is actually true. That last part is true. I have. I think I have two octave. I know I definitely have two octave, but you definitely have three plus. So that, right. that part's true. The other uh, parts are false. Uh, um, I, uh, <laughs> I just like that you asked me what my range was the other day, what your range was the other day. And I have no fucking idea, you John. I, 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 I have no idea. I figured you would have known because you Because I wrote did. a song no, for you? No, because we were running... <laughs> Because I watched you sing a song. <laughs> I am now the master of I your just, voice. I thought you'd have a better guess than me. <laughs> I, I mean, I can see why you'd think that. But it's, you know, it's not that hard. You sit down on a piano and go, well, I can sing that. I, I can't sing that. I'm somewhere in between. Okay. Well, and it's just, it's I'm all. sorry. I think what's funny about it is the idea that, um, is the con it, in order to have to answer that question <laughs> in order to have to answer that question you have to put yourself in a position <laughs> where you probably should know the answer to that question <laughs> yeah. that's what's funny to me about it hey i think i'm auditioning for mama mia what's my range well i don't know but you should probably figure that out before you <laughs> audition for mama mia I think I'm going to be on Broadway. What's my range? Hey, I'm going to New York next week. Can I be on Broadway? What's my range? I'm going to New York next week. I'm What's my range? One to eight? It's like a four, right? Yep. Scale of one to eight. Scale of one to, f- one one to my, eight. What's scale, my range? Scale of one to eight. What's my range? Like a four? <laughs> it's like a four, right? Yeah, 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 sure. Sure, John. It's a four. Yeah. Go, go with four. 
Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, uh, what are you singing yesterday? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, I'll be uh, doing. I'll uh, be singing Mamma Mia. Uh, okay. Um, uh, what, uh, are you a tenor? What's your? I'm a four. I'm a four. Oh, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Mamma Mia. <laughs> Here we go again. My my, how my, could my, I resist I'm a Mamma you? Mamma Mia. Um, jump over a cliff. By the way, a lot of this audio spiked, so it's might sound jank. Oh, yeah. Well, I was scr- yeah. yeah I we mean, were. Scr- I guess we got a test for. I guess I really does time. need to do a do a I could take a class because I was yelling a lot into the mic. I feel like. Never mind. God, your eyes are ugly. Uh. (laughs) (laughs) So $500 is a lot of money.